okay once you click on it this is the screen you're gonna get from here if you press this you turn up the volume from your Mac and you put it down um, you can be in a pretty long range okay this connected via Wi-Fi to your Mac iMac you also have mouse control okay which uh, I don't know if you guys can see it on my Mac. Let me just focus that. Well, you guys can't really see my mouse there, but it's moving. Um, it works fairly well. Actually, really well. It's not the most comfortable. Just by clicking, you can click just by tapping your screen. Okay, there's uh, other options in this that work really great. And all these. So we're just gonna go to iTunes, which many of you might do. So we click on that. And yeah, there we go. As you can see the iMac just went into iTunes. So then if we press play, it's gonna play whatever song is there first. Now the volume is really low, so I'm just gonna put it higher. Higher, 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 higher. Okay, that's all being done from the control itself. The remote from the iPhone. Put it down. Next song. Next song. Next song. Okay. Now, what I use it mostly for is when I'm watching movies and if I'm watching a movie. And I just want to turn up the volume and turn it down. Okay, pause it. And when you want to turn off your Mac, just scroll down. Okay, these are all the options that you have on it, just in case. I'll just show you quickly. Okay, they all work perfect. Okay, plus up here, you can see the apps that you may have and you may want to open. Okay, that's from. Those are the ones that you might have them like you can access them really fast um, and then just put shut down and I'm just gonna shut it down this would be the end of the video so you're gonna see that it shuts down although it's on iTunes right now okay and you're gonna see that when you put shut down it just shuts down automatically and your remote will be like this so then what you have to do is just get out of it and that's it so this app I would definitely give it a 10 out of 10 it works perfect just like I wanted it to um, the other ones beside it don't pay attention to those this one's the one you want the remote um, I'll just open it again settings Okay, so basically for this to work with your iMac, um, it tells you to download, okay, you need to download something from, from this website, right there, download it free at www.remote.com. So that you have to download into your iMac, you install it, and once that that's installed, it works perfect okay then you just sync it up with this and it works so it's really fast the installation was really fast as well and everything works really fine so I would definitely give this a 10 out of 10 and that's about it thank you for watching